Well, hey guys, long time no see. It's been like four days, maybe, maybe even just three. I feel like that's been a record for me lately. Um, how's everybody been? It's Tuesday. This is March 13th and I am Dion Woods with the Turquoise Iris. Um, you can find all of my available work at theturquoiseiris.com uh, where I have my hand-painted furniture and art. I have tutorials available as well as that's where you can register for my art classes and my paint my uh, hi Q I just finished your present yep so hey guys say hello jazz hands I've missed you oh my goodness I have been so busy and we had baseball over the the weekend but I'm working on this dresser and tell you what I have nine spots left for my next class. Hi, Chandra and Brandy and Amber and Chastity. Um, my next class, I have nine spots left, and it's on the 24th of March. I know it's after spring break, and I know that, you know, we're like, can't think about it, but I'm gonna go ahead and pin the link right now um, in case anybody wants to grab one of those spots. Um, yeah, I have a present for you, Q, and I'm giving it to you on Friday. Well, I mean, I'm giving it to you via the screen. Um, but yes, I am working on a custom order right now and she asked for kind of my Monet look and kind of, it's like a sunset. Anyway, this is just the first coat and it's been drying for a couple of days and I need to get um, a little bit of white on here. Um, but this is kind of just a sneak peek of what I'll be working on in my class on March 24th. Um, I'm gonna do kind of my Monet finish and then also my online class. Um, will be in April. I think April 15th. We're going to do that as well. Yee. Hi, Marlis. Hi, Dawn. Oh, thank you. I hope y'all are having a wonderful day. Um, so yeah, I'm going to do that. And gosh, I was just thinking before I went live, I would have loved to have gotten my present put together. Look what I got for my birthday. My beautiful sister-in-law and brother-in-law, they bought me. Is this a tough girl or what? Look, this is a shop stool, mechanics, or painters. Look at this. Was this not, not the most thoughtful gift ever? Oh, I wish someone would put it together. That's what one of those sons should be for, right? Put my stool together so I can roll around this garage. That's what I need. Instead, I'm on this little cushion. Oh, is that awesome? That was such a thoughtful gift. I got my, my wall done, you guys. Um, if you have noticed that I I finished my new staging wall, and that was also my birthday gift for my husband, because I've been asking for it for two years. Now you need sawhorses. Girl, I got those over in the corner. I just don't ever use them. I got sawhorses. But yeah, my wall is done, and um, I did a tutorial and was going to have that available, and I can't get it uploaded. Again, I need some help. I could not get it uploaded to YouTube. So anyway, that, that tutorial for the wall will be available sometime, sometime. So um, anyway, that's been going on. I've got my class coming up. We're getting ready to leave tomorrow for Biloxi for baseball. Get off of that floor, right? I know my sister-in-law, Janae, she was like, why are you sitting on the floor? I always sit on the floor. I don't know, I'm just that kind of person. I sit on the floor here, I sit on the floor in the living room, I stretch, I'm just a floor girl. I don't know. That sounds weird. It sounds a, it sounds a little weird, but don't, don't make it weird. Let's not, let's not make it weird. Um, but anyway, I'm working on this piece. This is a custom order. Um, my customer actually bought something that was already sold. And so that stool goes together in seconds. Thank you. That means I will attempt it. If it's seconds, I can do, but if I have to read the instructions, it's likely that I will wait for someone else to do it. I mean, I'm just telling you. I'm, I'm not going to pretend that I will open it up and read the instructions and take my time on it. I'm not going to lie. Um, so anyway, this I started a couple of days ago with Mo Bohemian Blue, um, Hey Sailor. I've got some Old 57. No, no, no. That's Prom Queen. This is Prom Queen. And then I put on my kissing booth, and of course it gave me a little purple. Um, 
I kept the, these two appliques on here, but I took off all the original hardware and I'll put it back on here because it's gorgeous. I mean, beautiful hardware. I can't wait to show you. Um, so then I did some Summer Crush with some sparkle because this here is my sunset. Um, so it's got some golden ticket in there and then my yellow. And so now I would like to add some white so we can just have a little bit of... Um, a little bit of clouds and such. And so what I just finished, which I can't show you, but I made something for Kawita, and I'm gonna show you all on Friday for Friday Night Lives. I may possibly be in the back seat of my, or front seat of my car at the ballpark. So I may have the dome light on, but by God, I will be there. 8.30 p.m. Central Time. Oh, okay, that's what I'm gonna do. Um, but I'm going to be there, and I made something for Kawita, and I'm going to show it to her um, on the Friday Night Live because I really didn't have anything else to be doing since I'll probably be in the car. My son plays at the exact same time that I need to be doing a Friday Night Live, um, and we'll be in Biloxi, Mississippi. So, um, your waxing is a workout. Yes, Kawita is working, is waxing, I hear today. Um, and not that Debbie's paint, Debbie's wax is fantastic. Um, but no, anyway, this is just a sneak peek of a, what I'm going to be working on in my next classes. Um, yes, so typically when I'm doing this, I paint on the side. I never turn it up until it's completely finished. It's not upside down. Will you cry? Oh, heck yeah, you're going to cry. I'm doing everything in my powers to make you cry. No, um, no, I don't know. It depends on, I don't know. I'm looking at it right now. You're gonna like it, Kawita. You're gonna like it. But I needed to do something special for you. So yes, I've got it finished and I love it. And yes, you're gonna love it. But whether you cry or not, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not trying to make you cry. I was just really teasing you. I'm really not trying to make you cry. Am I in charge of Friday night? No. No, you're not in charge. <laughs> no. Of course, I'm kidding as well. Um, I don't ever feel like either one of us are really in charge other than you will have to paint. Um, I will need you to be doing something. Now you can make me something. Why is it? Yeah, absolutely, Julie. This is the way I paint this style. Yep, it's absolutely on its side for a reason. This is how I paint the dresser. Um, so, um, this is just kind of a sneak peek of what I'll be doing in my March 24th class and my April 15th in uh, online class. But this is how I paint uh, my style where I do um, a sunset or a sunrise or what I'm, another one that I call my Monet. Um, and this, so that's what I'm featuring in my class. So I just thought I'm leaving town in the morning and I need to kind of move along on this sucker um, for my precious client to not have to wait too long. Um, so I just thought you guys could join me for a little cloud action, that's all. I'm using my paint pixie brush in the French tip. As you can see, this is my favorite. Um, so I'm just gonna dab a little white on here and I know that it looks like a total hot mess right now as it should, because we always do hot messes before we get better. That's why I'm completely fine with a hot mess. I have a couple of pieces that I went to pick up today and um, found out when I got there. They changed their hours and the store was closed. So I didn't get to get my other two pieces, but I do have this one. And thank you, Kawita, for sharing this, this live. I appreciate you. So yep, it's gonna look like a hot mess for just a few minutes, everyone. Actually, it's gonna look like a hot mess probably for a few more days because I'm going out of town. Hear that? Oh, Linda, thank you, honey. You're amazing. No, you are. You are. Is 
So this color I just added is a bead board by DIY Paint. I'm just adding a little bit of soft whiteness over the queen bee, which is my sunset. I know it looks like a hot mess, but I'm not the least bit worried about it. This is one of my favorite styles to paint. I always do it on its side to get the look that I'm after. Sorry guys, I'm concentrating. If y'all are commenting, I am spraying this with water. Like I said, this is just a little sneak peek of what I'll be doing in my class on March 24th. If you're coming to see me, I'll be painting the piece of furniture on its side. Yes, I do love this sprayer. Um, I do still use my other one though because sometimes I need more power. Um, you know, those days when I'm painting with Kawita and I need a power washer, I go ahead and grab the other one. But this one's pretty soft. Um, and I love this one more. I love to love it with my canvases. Thank you for making you a present. Uh-huh, you go love it, sissy. This sprayer is from Hobby Lobby. Um, it's in the art aisle. It's $9.99. Get your coupon. You get it for five. Mine was gifted to me from LaDawn of LaDawn's Creations because she's awesome like that. I'm just working on a reflection on the water and a little bit of cloud. This is all about layering colors and making a hot mess and keep working on it till you get it um, the way that you want it. Water sprayer. I know. I have two of them. I wish you did too, Beethress. I love my new earrings, by the way. You're awesome. I love them. Thank you so much, Beethress. Are you selling those in your booth? Beatrice, are you going to be selling those? Everybody's like, what is she doing? Oh, thank you, sweetheart. I love it. Beatrice is a friend of mine who's in my creative connection. She's just got a booth set up there. And Beatrice, are you in Toronto? You're in Toronto, right? BNC Vintage Furniture, is that right, sister? Guess what we need? Guess what we need? We need um Sparkle. Let's get golden ticket. Hang tight. Let me grab some golden tickets. Sorry, I should have been more prepared. But you know what? I did this at the last minute without really thinking. What do you do with the drips at the bottom? I'll let them drip onto the floor. Did 
just drips right off onto my little thingamajigger, my towel that's underneath it. Okay, let me grab a little brush. Okay, let's use this little dill hickey. Dill hickey, everybody know what a dill hickey is? Okay, see this little girl? We're gonna get her. You're gonna make it to one of my classes? Oh, I certainly hope so. So this is Golden Ticket and it's by Debbie's Design Diary. It's our DIY paint. And I'm gonna put some sparkle on here. This is our sunset. This is a custom order I'm working on. I'm also going to be doing this finish in a class on March 24th. This will just be kind of a little sneak peek of what I'm doing. This goes on as a, it's a sheer, um, it's kind of a, like a liquid patina is what it's called. So it goes on very sheer. And really it's become my new favorite product in the entire line. Thank you, Lori. Thank you. I got my wall finished, you guys. Have you seen it? OMG. My husband came through for my birthday pretty good. Okay. So I just kind of put that in a few areas and now I'm gonna lightly spritz the gold with this lightly, just to kind of get it run in a smidge. Smidge, you know how much that is, right? It's always gonna look like a total hot mess before it gets better. Please put your faith in me. Please put your faith in me, we'll get it. Don't panic. Don't give me angry faces and tell me I'm ruining it. Guys, I also wanted to make a little bit of announcement. I, um, you know, if you have followed me for a while, you know I have my creative connection and I closed it last month at 200 people. Um, but I am so super stoked to let you know that I've opened it back up today. Actually, I opened it up about three days ago. So if you are, there are 800 people asking to be in my creative connection. Um, I'm only gonna give about 25 to 30 spots, so if you want in that group, in my creative connection, feel free. Just go to theturquoisiris.com. It's a $26 a month fee, um, and I just bill you every month. I'd love to hear about your story, how you started out. Your first sell online. Oh, I need to have someone interview me, don't I? Don't we need someone doing that, I guess? That would be sweet. Thank you, Haley, for your interest in my story. Uh, maybe one day someone will interview me. I mean, I, I feel like I've told everybody, but you know what? There's always, I mean, I clearly have it, so I appreciate that. That's really sweet of you to ask. Um, but anyway, I'm opening my Creative Connection back up, so if you're interested or if you're one of those 800 people that have asked to join, please feel free to um, go ahead and get yourself registered at theturquoiseiris.com. Um, I'm going to open it back up to about 25, 30 more people. But I'd like to keep the group pretty small. I really, like today, we, we pulled up two people in the group that, of course, agreed. Um, and we just gave them an opportunity to be live. They'd never gone live before. And I just kind of interviewed them and kind of let themselves talk for a few minutes and tell us a little bit about themselves. And that's just one of my favorite things to do in the group because it, this is intimidating to go live on Facebook, but if you're in a closed group with some close friends, not really close, but close is in your group, um, then be interviewed, it's so much easier. So Anissa and Mandy were troopers today and I got to pull them up and do live with them and do a little 20 minute interview. Um, so that's just one of, the one of the many things we do in my group. 
But if you are interested in being in my Creative Connection, like I said, there's over 800 people that have asked. Now's your chance. So I'm just gonna keep adding a little bit of gold. This is one of those techniques, you guys, that I have to walk away from. I have to just let it dry completely, step back, because I do try to, I mean, it's, it's an, there's an art to it, and so I have to step back from it and let it kind of morph into what it wants to be. Um, but this is a little sneak peek of what I'll be working on March 25th in my in-person class here in, at Reclaim Warehouse. So, like I said, I'm at that point where I think I better just kind of walk away. Except for right here. I feel like I need a little bit of something, something right here. And I'm gonna go get some more blue too. I wanna add some more of my, um, my prom queen. I want some prom queen in the water here. Thank you, whoever just shared that. I love you. That's kind of kind of forward to say that, isn't it? I love you, but you know what I mean. You know what I mean. I love your graciousness. <clears throat> I don't know if you guys can see this, but not only is it wet, it's actually got a shimmer on it. But when it dries, it won't be quite so bright and it won't be reflecting as much. Um, Anissa, you are sweet as pie, and thank you again for going live with me today in the group. Um, Prom queen in the water sounds like a horror movie. Or, or it's prom queen by the beach. And that doesn't sound like a horror movie, Miss Pris Kristen. Right, right, guys? So I'm gonna keep adding a little bit of white. Um, if you have any questions about my class or about my group, holla, you know where to find me. For now, you guys get out of here and be awesome. <laughs>